between recordings, I read a little bit of a walkthrough while taking a huge ass jump. So I feel like my actual vitality has been revitalized. Okay. 44 cal. I. Uh, what do I want with you? Be a fighter. Man, that's too much work. Why can't you do that yourself? Like, make your own damn plate. Great, now I look like Bart, but quit. This feels so redundant, it's not even funny. I'm salty right now, but it's probably not that bad. This guy looking like Bart's in the city. What about Chris Brown? Job. You know how I do things. Yo, Chris Brown looking like he about to sell you some microwavable rice. Quip. So why is it that two of your homies look exactly the same when they're onion nights? Like, Wheezy and Drizzy looking identical. So I want you, I want like Final Fantasy 1 when I play that. I want you block. What the hell is that? My sucking headphone earbud wants to come back to life. All I did was bend my head over and all of a sudden started making noise. That's so weird. What am I doing? Matter of fact, I'm being Ed right now. These ends are free. That shit scared the hell out of me. Let me turn it a little. Oh, wow, the OST is sounding more booming now. Beaming, actually. Any hidden passageways? I don't want no potions, sorry. Cool. No, I'm a virgin. Uh, at least she's just not grinding on me no more. Was she even doing that? My perspective is all whack. Just like in Final Fantasy V, or in this case, the other way around. Yo, know, talk to my ass. Why the bartender 
not trying to talk to me. I guess that's another potion. See, I don't gotta buy shit. For now. See, to me, I could never do that. Sleeping at an inn like that, where like, someone can just walk in and just... I mean, even in other RPGs, at least you've got your own proper room. You're not <laughs> out by the counter sleeping on a bed. You got some privacy. I have a feeling I'm not supposed to do this. Like, if I come back here, there will be nicer stuff, but I don't care, man. And that makes me wonder, is the li inventory limited, like in 4? Because that was mad annoying. Boom's trying to get this. Okay, so that just does that. It's whack. I might need to forget that one. Bought that for nothing there. Oh no. I'm just a dumbass. Okay, I get it. The letter shield is supposed to be on one of your hands, not your arms. So drunkenly cycling through this menu is probably not very entertaining for you. Let me check this. Ooh. Okay, so thieves can't equip knives, but you know who probably can equip knives? Now that's what I'm talking about. What about these? You see, red mages are supposed to be more so swordsmen than actual mages. But they probably got that advantage. And they do. Rock and red ball main letter. Everything in life is a center. <sighs> is that everything I want? I don't know what does what. 
Is there any possible way for me to get an item description? Uh, let me grind up for some nunchucks. You want to know what I really like about this game over one? This pause menu doesn't have any music to it, so that's wavy. That was so annoying. Even in Legend of Dragoon, that was extremely annoying, which I need to get to reviewing at some point. Hope these guys don't clap my shit. Okay, so in terms of damage, he's a little nasty with it. I fucks with that. Oh. And that did nothing. I read the walkthrough and I could have used like something to do more damage. I think Southern Cross to my first boss, but nah. I want to be a little more blind when I play these. That was a nice ass crit. Drizzy be putting in work now. How much is the next level though? Not much. And I need to get into one more battle before I get some nunchucks for the fighter. Maybe I'll get a long sword as well. Just another one for the red mage. If he still is a swordsman. And they didn't completely nerf red mages in this one, which would suck. Wow, the encounter rate is actually well behaved in this game, which actually sucks in this regard. Because I'm trying to get since this fights right now. Weezy, don't fall off on me. Same with Breezy. You see, the werewolves ain't really that nasty with it unless they crit. Then they really nasty with it. Ah. Uh. This tamarindo is really nice. I'm not. These enemies give a whack EXP. I easy. Okay. So those are actually whack for him. Am I missing out on something? I probably am, like, if you level up with him a little, it'll have the opposite effect. And if this is, like, Final Fantasy 2, then what hand your character is most proficient at also plays a role.
These mosquitoes are mad annoying. They weaving through everything. Ain't one of them got clapped in this round. That's crazy. Ooh. <laughs> Those pieces were hitting hard. Like, damn. Like, my jaw felt that. <laughs> I don't know about the mosquito's jaw. They got their exoskeleton on the outside. Hence why it's called an exoskeleton. We rich yet? Skill up. So that means they're nastier with it now? Cause I know about level ups, but I don't necessarily know anything about skill ups. And this doesn't seem to have job levels like in five. Seems a lot more like tactics in that regard. Well JP was used to unlock stuff in tactics. You did have job levels as well. And if I remember correctly, you could freely change jobs without having to expend any points. Come on, get a clutch victory. Whoo, Drizzy been putting in work. I named him Apley. Should have made him a thief, though. Man, just because this is your village, they let you sleep in the inn for free? You don't even got your own bread? That's crazy. You don't get charged at all. Oh no, now I get it. This game has an old school mechanic I don't really like where hitting confirm just continues the sequence. It doesn't like close any menus or anything. So I'm double dipping when I buy stuff. Oh, where? I got me buying shit I don't need. I no take this. I ended up buying that twice, didn't I? Oh no, 
now I realize you can equip two long swords. A word? That's going to be the only thing I say for the rest of this OP, right? <laughs> Until I understand it to a science. Now I'm starting to get it in my muscle memory. Whoo, now I'm the nastiest guy here. Ain't I just a stinker? Knife. Just rock two knives for me. I like that y'all dual wielding. Uh. Play again soon. I'll play again real soon. Damn, I'm just nasty now. And their swings are mad fast sounding now. <laughs> that are dual wielding. So that's it. So if I had dual nunchucks, I'd be hitting harder with the monk, right? That was one thing I really liked about Breath of Fire 4, when you can hit twice. Like, it felt like a dynamic changer. Like that felt way faster. Okay, I think he got his damage up during that level up. I like this sound theme though. Okay. Let me talk to this dude who's a chilling campsite in his own village. Oh, he shook. So DJ played this in the remake and he got stuck. I don't gotta worry about HP since I think the ends will let me crash here for nothing too. So the shopkeeper ain't here. That's messed up. Oh, let me talk to these ghosts. Let's see if they cool. I can imagine this would cause some emulation problems. Man, they mad salty that they don't got. That's it? Yo, that's it, and he gave you an airship for nothing. Like, y'all gonna help us out, I right. I'm gonna just give you my airship like that, like nothing. And you can sleep in the brib. Yo, Sid Wavy in this. I hope I'm not stuck now. <laughs> I 
Okay, I can stand over that chair. I was type nervous, like, oh, they box you in on that one. You're supposed to sleep on that one if you don't want to F your file up. That would get me shook, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm feeling the way this game is paced. I don't think I'm supposed to go there yet. But hold on, let me look at this shadowing effect. It's getting me type suspicious. This guy's so shook, he doesn't even realize he has a free brim for a week. He'd rather camp out on the boonies. What a bitch. So I'm supposed to look for Sid's airship. I don't even know if I'm in the right level. My whole party could be like... Care Bears right now and... Oh no, that's the airship. I thought that was the sand. Or maybe they don't have the... Oh, I don't even know. I'm guessing I'm supposed to go here. I hope these guys don't just have the power to whack me like it's nothing. Ooh, that wasn't even a crit. Oh, is this the place where they just whack you like it's nothing? Like DK was complaining about this one. Well, I know the tendency in this game for them to bully on one person. Ooh, I like that. They're spreading out who they hit. It makes the grind way easier. Damn, these guys ain't messing around. I feel like I just lost that fight. <laughs> That's right, play this uplifting 80s music. So all the stores shut down? Oh no. Well, I think that's the shopkeeper, but... And no one here really trying to sell me some stuff. They're all having an existential crisis over the fact that they don't got faces no more. Like, I'm not on a journey to try to help the asses. You're in my way, sir. Come on. Don't be like that. Doing me mad dirty. That's what they doing. So I guess now should be the point where I grind for real this time. In that case, I'm gonna cut it. This has been your boy, Mr. Market Seven. Suck my dick.